Yo, what's up guys? Um So more RST stuff again. Haha <laughs> um I don't want people to be like, oh you only like the small cars and whatnot and I mean I do like the smaller cars just because they are cheaper and I'm on a budget kind of. Um But so for the channel I got something bigger. Very much so bigger. This thing is huge compared to my 118 scale. This is the 110 scale E Max. Um, it's the older version, but it has the newer body on it. The guy didn't notice until after, so I just got to drill holes for the uh, body post in the back. Um, this is going to be the project car for about a month. Um, I have to buy, let's see, what do I have to buy? I gotta buy some screws and stuff for the wheelie bar. I gotta buy batteries. I gotta buy charger. I gotta buy, what the fuck? There's a screw in here. Um, I gotta buy, um, uh, Motor and ESC, which will be soon. Um, no problem. I don't know exactly what the screw was from, but it was on here. Um, let's just take this off. and uh, It looks pretty stripped down anyway, so screw it. Um, Got to buy... So I, I, like I said, it's a project car. Um... Springs are all right. They're pretty good. Um, that it doesn't bottom out too bad. Tons of suspension travel. Holy shit, dude. This thing is insane. There's even more, but the, the springs in the back are, um, I think, upgraded springs to where it doesn't, you know, go all crazy and squat down real hard. Um... I will probably, uh, I'll probably leave the, the weight that's in there because I don't know exactly what weight is in here. Um, uh, I'm not going to worry about this motor mount over here that I know of because I'm going to try to put the motor mount right here or the motor, I should say, right here because it's not bent. Up here is bent. I'll probably just bend it back just just for sake. Um, I don't know exactly what this is. I can't tell if this is the two speed. Or the one speed. I want to say that this is the two speed. Um, the two speed one. Um, if anybody that's watching knows, let me know. Um, on this gearbox, I think it's the two speed, but I can't tell because this I don't remember seeing this on the one speeds on YouTube. Um, but so. Like I said, it's gonna be gonna be the project car. Um, next paycheck, I'm gonna be buying the motor from him. I don't know if I want the motor because the motor is a uh, it's a, from the Savage uh, XS Flux, so it's a small one, not the big one, or the uh, WR8. I want to say the WR8 one eighth scale, but it's more like a one tenth scale car. Because it's small, but it goes like 30, 40 miles an hour with a 3S. Um, but this thing is huge, guys. But yeah, like, the wheelie bar's not, not even properly hooked up. Um, I might take the wheelie bar off at the moment. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. These two parts right here different in the back so he fucking rigged all of that I mean he rigged it but a lot of these screws like that screw see the screws are swapped right here on the brace um I don't know exactly what these are for um pretty thick uh the plastic drive shafts I will upgrade them to the uh to the 
other drive shafts, the um, the aluminum rod ones or the metal rod ones, whatever. Uh, servos, a pretty standard servo. I want to say it's a stock servo. Oops, sorry. Uh, sounds pretty good. Doesn't sound stripped up or anything. But I just wanted to show you guys that this is this was the uh, surprise. Um, upgraded shocks will probably come in a little bit later after I get it running and moving. Um, so that will that will eventually get done. So this tire's all ripped right here. I paid forty dollars cash and I did a trade with some baby stuff that we don't aren't going to be using. Uh, let's get this out of the way. This is going to have the the new setup this week, but I won't be able to drive it because there's no servo because the servo was too small. I ordered a a middle gear uh, servo for like twelve dollars, but it hasn't shipped yet. I don't know. It's gonna take a while to get here, so this will probably be on hold, unless I throw that one ten scale stuff onto the Emacs. Um, but I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do with it at the moment. It's just gonna sit here, pretty looking. Um, I might move the if I do buy that motor in ESC. I'm gonna move it to this probably. If it if it doesn't look like it will fit on here, because it is one tenth scale, but I don't feel like that's it's a really small motor. Um so I might move to one eighth scale onto this, but it's supposed to hold the twin 540 size cans. Um at the moment, I wanna say, or it's the twin 380s. Um if anybody does know, please let me know. Um but I do want to say that this is the, the two gear. I'll have to take it apart and check all that out. But I just wanted to let you guys know that this will be getting started. Um, I'm super stoked because this will be the biggest RC that I have so far. Um, and I, I I was, I did get an offer or a one, uh, like the total for this car from the guy that I'll be buying will be like 140 in cash. Um... And then I want to say about another hundred to get what I want on here, not in, uh, because I'm gonna have to buy a receiver box, a whole receiver box, um, for on here. But I don't know where I'm gonna put it. Um, I don't remember where it's supposed to go exactly. Like I said, this is my first one. Uh, it's the older one, so. I'm going to have to kind of look far back because nowadays they got the newer brushless edition one, which is this body. But again, like I said, I'm going to have to drill the holes, which I don't mind because it's going to be my basher body. Um, I'm going to order me either an SVT uh, Raptor body um, uh, body for it, or I'm going to get the C10 Chevy body just, just for like all around looks. Um... This this basher body will have um, lights on it, and the C10 will have light bars. Uh, I might go with the halo lights on here. Um, I'm not exactly sure, but like I said, it's all going to be project. Um, I did get, like I was trying to say earlier, but I got confused and mixed up. Um, I was going to get a mini E Revo with a 110 scale setup on it. Um, it's not a very fast 110 scale. It's a 3500 kV uh, reactor or Raider reactor motor in ESC. Um, and he wanted 150 for it. It came with batteries, charger, um, batteries and charger, uh, remote. It was the whole thing, whole deal for 150 But I wanted the bigger car and I wanted the enjoy building it the way I want it instead of just having a setup and then going from there. Um, I don't know if any of you guys will agree with me, but this, this is going to be fun for me to do. It's going to be fun for me to build up. It's going to be, um, all around really fun for me to get. Um, 
with my brushless system that I do have, I might buy another 118 scale that will fit it. It's um, the Hummer Nitro RCX that I might get. I don't know for sure. These foam inserts are kind of kind of hard, um, but I don't really care right now. Um, so more to come with this one and definitely a lot to come from this one. Like, look at that. My hand, my hand is huge. I have really, I have big hands and that tire is huge. Uh, he had a, he sent me a picture of a, a 16.9 ounce Coke bottle and it was legit like that big to it. It was so small. Um, like this, this kind of does justice for it, but it kind of doesn't like this thing is huge for a 110 scale. Um, I, I love this thing uh, already. Um, but I think that will be it for right now for this video. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and let me know what you guys think.